Epidemiologists are concerned about the low vaccination rates in the Latino community here in Arizona, and they're warning that COVID will continue to hit the Hispanic or Latino communities hard if those vaccination rates don't improve quickly. Bailey Miller joins us live now with this story, Bailey. Yeah, Dignity Health, the doctors we spoke with say they've seen a mild increase in patients uh, in the patient population, adding that predominantly those numbers are coming from the Hispanic and Latino communities, which is why they're stressing the importance of the vaccine. Doctors are urging the Latino and Hispanic communities to get vaccinated because this population in the state is falling behind. It really breaks my heart because as a physician and as a science person, I know that this vaccine is highly effective and highly safe. It's saving life. Dr. Omar Gonzalez, an epidemiologist at Dignity Health, says only about 13% of the total vaccination rate is from Latinos, when the state is comprised of 30 to 33% of that population. The reason for this, he says, could be a number of things, from economic hardship, lack of transportation, to lack of insurance. In addition to, uh, misinformation, not able to get um, to accurate sources for information on vaccine, creating a lot of uh, conspiracy theories or misinformation that make uh, someone very hesitant to go for it. But Gonzalez says the issues that come with these lower vaccination numbers are serious. According to the CDC, Hispanics or Latinos are more than three times as likely to be hospitalized with COVID as white people, and Hispanics are more than twice as likely to die from the virus. Of acquisition and transmission, in consequence, uh, to me, means that our population are exposed, are vulnerable still. Uh, we need to reach to them now, doctors are asking this community to do their research and get vaccinated, stressing that it is important to do so and it's safe and effective. Reporting live, I'm Bailey Miller, Fox 10 News.